A herd of parched buffalo move into a water hole. Danger follows. These cats have made plans to eat tonight. They're not greedy. Just one buffalo is all they need. Preferably not a one-ton bull with attitude. Because then the lions will learn what it means to mess with a boss. A herd of Cape buffalo head for water after a long day grazing the savannah. They are the largest of all buffalo species. Slow movers now, but they can pivot from docile to destructive in an instant. Vegans by nature, yet quite capable of disposing of their enemies. Even potential ones. Through a buffalo's eyes, lion cubs are tomorrow's assassins. A pride of lions has the numbers to successfully attack a herd and do serious damage. But this pair of males are either fearless or desperate to approach without backup. Buffalo soldiers with lethal weapons patrol the perimeter. Strategies learned from the pride kick in. Be patient. Observe. Let the buffaloes drink their fill. Let them think they are safe. Approach with extreme caution. And when their guard is down, stir it up. Let the chaos and confusion do the job of severing protective bonds between mother and calf, between the strong and the weak. The vulnerable may be left behind, separated from the herd, exhausted, confused, frightened, ready for the taking. When the dust settles, the victim will be revealed. But, surprise, a healthy, mature bull. You can tell by the helmet-like shield of horn on his forehead. It's called a boss. He's at least eight years old, and he hasn't lived this long without facing lions head on. He may have even killed one in the past, but two? The buffalo's robust body is his first line of defense. Extremely thick and dense ribs protect chest and organs. The hide around his neck is almost five centimeters thick. The lions focus on the least protected area. They aim to sever his spinal cord. The longer he stands his ground, the better the chances that the herd will return to save him. But the distress calls dissolve into the still savannah. The herd has moved on. The bull is alone, and his most efficient weapons are useless. He can't position himself to impale his attackers. He must get the lion off his back, put an end to the crazy rodeo. The annoying enemy is getting its lesson. Teeth and claws are not enough to grip this leathery old bull. There's nothing to hold on to, except the tail. That's no way to catch a buffalo. The laws of physics dictate this tug of war can only end one way. Now the bull can look his enemies in the eye. And they must finally face the business end of the buffalo. The lion's shock and awe tactics are no match for his unbreakable spirit. And if they keep up these half-hearted taunts, the wasted blood they wear may soon be theirs. It's over. Hmm, not quite. There's still the time and the desire to serve up one last morsel of humiliation. To a couple of cats who think a buffalo is just a piece of meat. They may be kings, but he is the boss. Today a buffalo lost his tail, and now he must find his herd. Want to see more videos of these magnificent animals? Check out our brand new Nature is Brutal playlist and learn more about big cats and other predators.